All right, we're going to take a cornerback now, uh, a spot that really was one of the strengths of the team last season. And the good news is if they just leave everything alone, it'll remain a strength. Uh, the biggest question is, will they leave things alone? Because uh, Dominique rogers Kamadi uh, has a big $8.5 million cap hit uh, in 2017. Might be a guy that they could think about trying to save some money there uh, and make him a cap casualty. Now, I know fans hate to hear that, but it's the financial reality. He's the number three cornerback on this team. He's supremely valuable. We all know that. Everyone saw what happened in the playoff game against the Packers. DRC goes out early, and Aaron Rodgers just locked in on whoever took his spot in the slot, whether it was Cody Sensabaugh or Trevin Wade, uh, and really abused them. But that being said, you're, this is a guy who's going to play 60% of the snaps, ideally. Meanwhile, Janoris Jenkins and Eli Apple are going to play 100% of the snaps. Didn't necessarily happen this year because Apple was banged up, and then Jenkins got banged up late in the year. But if those two guys stay healthy, those are outside corners. They never come off the field. And DRC plays the slot, which again, in today's NFL, is a big part of the defensive packages. But it's not an every down player. So are you going to put out $8.5 million cap hit for a guy who's a situational player? Now, I would. I think he's that valuable. Uh, I think, again, I said earlier that if Apple and Jenkins stay healthy, well, if they don't, you need someone who can play outside. And DRC certainly did that. I mean, for as good a year as he had this year, and he did a lot of it in the slot, he was at his best when Apple was out or when Jenkins was out. And he was able to be back in his comfortable spot outside. So uh, super valuable to have him as a backup option to those two guys. The fact that he is signed, you don't have to do anything. Just bring him back. That's the way I would go. Because the other thing, all these times we talk about cap casualties and, and saving money against the salary cap. Well, if you get rid of DRC, you still need to replace him somehow. So you're not going to save 8.5 because you have to you know, ex expend out 4 or $5 million to get a suitable replacement for him. So I think just leave it as is. You have three really solid cornerbacks in Jenkins, Apple, and DRC going into next year. Uh, that's more than most teams can say. And then you bring back a Cody Sensabaugh as the fourth corner. Maybe even, you know, Trevor Wade. I know fans aren't going to hear that. But if he's used appropriately as a fifth corner and a special teams guy, uh, he has some value. And then I draft a corner in the mid-rounds, maybe third, fourth round, uh, just to get some young legs in there because DRC isn't going to be around forever. Uh, so that's the way I would approach it. I know fans don't even want to hear about it. Uh, but I think DRC should be back, but we'll wait and see because that $8.5 million is eating a lot of the cap. Uh, so we'll see how Jerry Reese thinks about it. I know how I think and I know how the fans think, so we'll see how it plays out.